Hello guys, how are you all doing today? Hope you're all fine. I'm a little bit tired because I've been making these videos all day long, but not a problem. Uh, today, I wanted to leave the last, the most difficult, the most heavier for me, the most difficult, the, the, the probably the best video I'm gonna make of these ones, and is ranking the whole Rage discography. Are you ready? Because I'm not, but I'm gonna do it anyway. once more I'm super nervous about doing this one is gonna be super super difficult for me but let's do it I love all of the albums or I really like a lot and as you know A is for perfect B is for great C is for really good D is for good and E I don't like them too much or I really don't like them that we're not gonna use E almost anything today so anyway let's start with 10 years in rage Awesome, awesome album. I enjoy it quite a lot. There's nothing else to say. Pretty special. I love the Blow in a Row. Super cool track. Um, it's a medley about all the songs. Super cool. Same goes with 21. One of my all time favorite albums with Victor Smolsky on the band. This has that groovy element to it that I really adore. Black in Mind. Black in Mind is the first one to go to be. It's would have been higher it really would have been higher but i listened to it so much as a teenager that some of the tracks they got really burned still awesome as fuck carved in stone sadly this one is gonna go to d it hurts putting album solo but i don't know maybe came in a really bad time for me but i didn't get to quite enjoy it so here we have it. Execution wearing it. It's gonna go to C. Okay, really good, really metal, but doesn't sound yet like Rage. So it's why it stays there. Uh, End of all days, of course, one of my all-time favorite Rage albums. Every song of it is perfect. I just like it a lot. I mean, you have classics like Higher Than The Sky there. I mean, what else do you need? Standard Power EP. Okay, this is going to B. Okay. That one is super special for me. I love all the four tracks. They're great. And that's why it's there. I mean, Woman is a super great track. Butterfield is a re recording of the Avenger album that we're gonna get soon. Super, super cool, okay? Okay, Full Moon is gonna go there with Carved in Stone. I'm not a big fan of that era of raids. I still love them, but not as much as I love the rest of raids, okay? Um, some cool store here and there, um, but not the same. Instead, from the cradle to the stage is going in C, because really like it, okay? Really great concert talking about the whole story of the band. Super cool. You have things from Avenger up to Unity that it was the no sorry, some chaser that it was the last album at the moment, okay? Give them me out. No, I don't know if I pronounce that correctly. But it's gonna go again somewhere here. Just for terrified it goes in C. I mean terrified, the title track, the orchestral version of Carvedin of sorry of Lord of the Flies. It deserves to be there. Ghost goes to be really like the album but i prefer 13 that we will get the last one it seems it's still pretty cool album okay even if it's e i'm gonna tell you something i love them all you know even if i don't like it as much as the other i love every rage release ever so there you have it jpo higher than the sky but it goes to c directly just for the cover of your breaker, it really deserves that spot, okay? In higher than the sky itself is great. Uh, in vain, Raging Acoustic, Japan on release, Japan on release, is gonna get here by the side of Ghost. Love yesterday, the cover, love all the acoustic versions of Romet. Sadly, it's just a Japan only release, even though I have two copies from it, it's great. Other Japan only release is 
this life from the vault that is gonna go again by the side of higher than the sky great gig we got it with the with the box set of the metal years in the 10 years in rates is great piece okay lingua the lingua mortis album from 1995 is gonna get in the same spot as the in vain okay not really dig the sound lots but i really adore the versions of fred you know so really quite neat okay uh, beyond the wall another one that deserves to be here i mean this was one of the first rate cps i ever loved as a teenager really even pre-teenager i love burial life i want you those for those who had nothing to lose pretty intense stuff i love it sadly this one the other lingua mortis album is going in here i'm sorry it hurts to do but not really a fan of that album it's missing pv i mean it lacks of pv for my taste still good okay the my way ep okay goes up here i love my way and I really enjoy the new versions of the re-recordings re from some Black in Mind classics. I saw them in the 20th anniversary of the Black in Mind tour and they were awesome as always. Okay, Perfect Man. I love that album. I really love that album and it deserves to be up here. Perfect album. Perfect Man is a fucking perfect album. Okay, Avengers, Depraved to Black with Prayers of Steel. Is gonna go here sounds more like rates that the two first rates albums with that I tell you everything Halloween uh, uh, Swarm Mellow Steel Aberration pretty great album for a band that just came out okay then we have a great hits that is the best of the noise years Japan only release and for personal reasons is gonna go here I mean, I listened to it lots as a kid, I had a burnt copy when I was a kid and it really made a way for me, really quite enjoy it, it takes me back to my younger times. The Refuge CP, the other one that has to come in here, I mean, just the cover of Thrust Kids Everybody deserves it. Okay, Reflections of a Shadow, guess what, here, I mean, you see in they are a pretty complete band, they, they touch on metal styles, you can tell, but Reflections of a Shadow, even though lots of people doesn't like it, I really adore. It's really difficult to make this fucking video, really. I'm telling you, super difficult to make this video, okay. Next up we have the Refuge album, I put it here because I thought it was a cool idea, okay. And I really love it, so it's gonna get here. I mean... Tracks like Let Me Go, Waterfalls, uh, fucking Summer's Winter, From the Ashes, great, great album. For me, it deserves to be here, it deserves to be high, super awesome, okay? The Some Chairs Here Archives, uh, I really love the demos they have on here. They are really great, so it deserves its space around here, okay? Really like the demos, like I'm telling you, the two new songs, they're great. Uh, Sun Chaser goes there, okay? Another album with Victor Smolsky, really good. Falling from Grace is great. So, Wait the Nightmares, you know, great. And Secrets in a Weird World, the album with I Discover 8, just belongs, the perfect the status, you know? It's just awesome piece, awesome album, perfect from beginning to end. Seasons of the Black. Up here. Again, great album, great, 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 great tracks on it. The new, uh, the new for uh, the new lineup is awesome. They deserve the best. I love them. Probably my second favorite Rage lineup ever. Okay, speak of the dead, gonna go around here. Not really a really big fan of that album. It still has some great tracks on it. Uh, strings to a web. This one goes here too. Uh, 
it's always it's so good that I always feel he's missing a few tracks, okay, and it's 14 tracks. Um, Eran does with Tomorrow Never Comes, that is a great track, okay? The Devil Strikes Again deserves to be high, 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 okay? It really deserves it. Great album. I'm, I just thank Lucky and, and Marcos for making such great albums with PB, okay? Um, that I just love them. Okay, The Missing Link, up here again. I, do I have to talk more? They're just awesome, okay? They're just awesome. Uh, Trapped, same. I mean, another perfect rates album. That's the album you have to start to listen to rates if you wanna like them. That one, okay? Then we go with the video link, okay? The Power of Metal Tour. And that one is gonna go here. No, a little bit more here, okay? Um, you know, and I love life albums, but over the studio albums is difficult, you know? I really love that tour. If you see the video, it's great. The album sounds great to just your face, you know? Unity. Uh, I'm sorry. It's my least favorite Rates album ever with, the, with Elmo. I used like a couple of songs from it. The rest is difficult for me to listen. I don't know if it's maybe personal reasons or what, something internal, bad memories or what. But I'm sorry to put it so down, it really hurts. Okay, Wings of Rage. It just came out, but already I can tell it's a fucking masterpiece. And it deserves to be there, okay? It really does. Okay, welcome to the other side. We're gonna add another with Victor to the list here, okay? <laughs> it really deserves it. Super atmospheric album, great stuff. Just love it. And guys, the last one we have to show is 13. That as you may expect, it belongs in here. I mean, just look at that, guys. Look at that. You see, just two, and I don't like too much, or I don't like it at all. Three in good. See, see, uh, all the line on really good. In awesome, we have all that, and in perfect look, it's just a fucking perfect band. You know, I just love them. They're my all-time favorite band. And here there is a little bit of a ranking. I have not the balls to, I don't have the balls to just put to say, okay, this is my favorite, this is my least favorite, because my least favorite are two, my favorites are the fucking rest, you know, so here there is, hope you liked the video, guys, hope it wasn't too long, and see you soon, and take care, I don't know when I will continue with this, because I am, I spent a fucking day doing it, so see you next time, see you soon, and take care.